What we're looking at here is what we call in Ojibwe language is Waganogan. We built this lodge from a photo that we had. The photo was taken in approximately 1890. This beautiful photo shows how the birch bark is laid on these rolls. The first thing we did was um, we went out, we harvested the cedar bark that you see here in the bottom of the lodge. And the second thing we did is uh, we, we harvested the uh, birch bark on the top. We peeled lots of birch trees in the forest. We were trying to be a little more sustainable about it because um, we targeted areas that were slated for clear cutting. We also harvested the maple poles that give the structure its stability. And so you'll see them on the outside. These are maple saplings. When we have this all repaired, what I'd like to do is put a couple of, of main supports up here because you know how thick the snow gets in the winter? Yeah. We'll start working on that fire pit too. And we'll make a slat in the center that way from the outside we can have a pole to lift it up. When the smoke comes out when we're done, we just push it back down. Or it can even be in here. You know, it could, it could tuck in like right here on one of these sticks here and we can push it up and it'll open up and come down. That's cool. So that way uh, the smoke will have a place to go. We got some more, a few more repair jobs to do, but I think this thing's almost ready to go. So I think in a few weeks what we can do is we can um, invite everybody out and just start doing our thing. Have a little feast. Mm-hmm.